The SmartLink AirCard is designed to complement your SmartLine control system perfectly. Most of what you'll need comes right in the box with the AirCard. All you will need is a drill. First, remove the SmartLink AirCard and accessory bag from the box. You'll want to verify that the unit is compatible with the controller. Controller versions 3.1 and higher are compatible. Each air card is shipped already activated, making setup a breeze. To register your air card or to add it to a facility, log on to www.smartlinknetwork.com. First time users will need to create a SmartLink account. Creating an account is easy. You only need to provide basic information and a valid email address. Adding sites and controllers is simple. Just fill in the required fields and the AirCard ID and you'll be up and running. Once the AirCard is registered, installing the rest of the unit is very straightforward. Screw the antenna into the bottom of the AirCard. Run the AirCard cable up through the bottom of the SmartLine controller case. You may need to widen an existing hole using a drill or punch out the area indicated on the bottom. Plug the cable into the RJ11 phone jack located inside the controller. Ensure that it is plugged in completely. You will want to verify all of the cables are out of the way and close the panel door, ensuring it is closed completely. The air card status will flash rapidly green until it cycles through. This will last approximately 15 to 30 seconds. The air card status will be a solid green light once it establishes communication and is connected to the network. If, after installation, the status light flashes red and you have verified the air card is on your SmartLink network, please contact the help desk.